In this video, I'll show you how to add a chat overlay to OBS. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's get right into this guide. Firstly, you go and open up OBS and go and select the scene which you want to go and add the chat to. So in this case, I want to go and add it to this one here called alerts. So then what we need to do is go and open up a web browser. This can be any, I use Google Chrome, and then just go to a search engine like Google. And there's a website we can go and use to add the chat to OBS. And this website is called Streamlabs. Now Streamlabs has many different features, but adding the chat is one of them. So go and type in S-T-R-E-A-M-L-A-B-S, just like so, and make sure you go to the official website, which is streamlabs.com, and here we are. Then all you need to do is go to the top right and go and tap login like so. And then what you need to do is go and log in or sign up to Streamlabs if you haven't already got an account to press sign up if you don't already have one. And then you can go and create a Streamlabs ID. Just gone and create my account and I'm going to go and let me explore on my own like this. And for now, you don't need to go and get Streamlabs desktop. But what you do need to do is go and connect your channels to Streamlabs. You need to go and connect them because then when you go and get a notification, it's going to be alerted on Streamlabs. And I'll show you how we can go and link Streamlabs to OBS. It's all going to make sense. Just keep watching. So in this case, we're going to use Twitch, but you can go and use YouTube or any other platform as well. And when you press connect, you then just need to go uh, and log into Twitch just like so. And then what you'll need to do is go and authorize Streamlabs for access to your account. So if you trust them, go and press authorize just like so. And here we are. And then you'll be taken back to the Streamlabs dashboard just like this. And you can go and connect more if you like. But for me, I'm just going to go and connect more later. I need to do things like setting up your tipping. And then here we are on the Streamlabs dashboard. And what you need to do is go over to the left left hand side and so you go and see this section called essentials and you need to go and tap on all widgets. So widgets are things you can go and add to your stream. So what you need to do is scroll down until you go and see the option for chat box. At the minute it's in the favorites but yeah just scroll down it should be quite easy to find. Go and tap on it. Then as you can see here it says include your channel's chat into your stream and make it look pretty. So what you can do is go and use a theme as you can see here they all are and if we scroll down at the moment this is what it currently looks like. So personally it's on this theme clean for me but you can have it on the box theme. Um, yeah so you want to see guys use whatever you want this Twitch as well so just use whatever you want. In this case I'm just going to go and use this clean one but as I said before it's completely up to you and then what you can do is scroll down and go and customize all these settings. You can go and change things like the color, the text color, things like that, the font size. I'm going to keep it really simple and leave it like that. So yeah then then all you need to do is go and press on copy and then we're going to go and get this URL and then what we can do is go and use this URL in OBS and it's going to have our chat there. I'm going to show you what it looks like. And so then once you copied it, all we need to do is go and minimize this for now and we can go back to OBS and then come to the sources and go and tap on the add source button in the bottom left and then go and tap on browser and then go and tap OK. And then what you can do is go and remove this current URL here. And then what we can do is go and paste in uh, the URL we just copied doing control V like so, and then go and tap OK. And that's it. We've now gone and added the chat. And this red box is gonna be the size and the position of it. And there we go. I just went and sent some messages and it's now appeared. So I'm actually gonna make this quite a lot bigger because at the moment it's really small. 